So I encourage you today, people of Ireland, people of Wexford, to educate yourself by reading your Holy Scriptures, to be educated also by the Holy Spirit. Because He is the quickener. He is the teacher. He is the prompter. He is God. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever should believe in Him would not perish, but have eternal life. That's right, people of Ireland. It's amazing what people choose to be easily offended about, isn't it? It's amazing. You see, the person who's trying to warn you about impending danger is your friend. If they are solemn, they're your friend. They're not your enemy. Your enemy allows you to go headlong into, into danger, doesn't warn you about it, or tells you about it when it's too late and says, yeah, I love you, I'm your friend, yeah, let's jump into the fire. That's not love, folks. That's what evil looks like. That's what evil looks like. That's not friendship. That's phony. It is fake. And so truth doesn't back down. Truth and love don't give up in the face of persecution. Love doesn't quit, folks. Love doesn't quit. You see, our forefathers had the foresight to give us certain inalienable rights, inviolable rights. And the vast majority of them are still in position today. They're still in place. There are still men who understand the Constitution and are willing to speak out about it. And they're the ones they want to silence. They're quite happy to suicide them, to kill them and make it look like suicide. They're quite happy to make them have an accident. They're quite happy to do these things, to silence those who are opposed to their evil agenda. They're quite happy to do it, not a bother on them. Because life has no value to the dead. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever should believe in him would not perish, but have eternal life. Keep speaking out, Ireland. Keep using your freedom of expression, Ireland. Do not quit. Do not back down. Stand on your constitution. Because the days are evil. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen.